Welcome to JSA TV. I'm Liz Edwards. We're here in lovely London at the International Finance Forum. We're covering the latest stories, trends and innovations from leaders in the digital infrastructure industry. Today I'm here with David Steinbauer from HSBC Data. Hi, how are you enjoying the morning so far? Thank you very much. Uh, great having you uh, or having me and uh, really I enjoy everything here. It's a great conference really. Yeah. I always go here and to, to, to meet all the, the, the key people I would say. Yeah, it's definitely a good conference. It's a great event in a great venue. But tell us, uh, for any of the viewers who don't know about HPC Data, tell us a little bit, bit about you. Thank you very much. So, um, well, HPC Data is basically um, streamlining the AI factory industry, meaning there's a new factory or new AI industry coming up um, for AI data centers. So everything is getting more dense, more greener, more scalable. So that's what we do. We build and develop data centers. Fabulous. Now, AI is a hot topic. That's going to be no surprise to anybody. Tell me how that affects what you guys are doing at HPC Data. So um, AI is, of course, our core level. We are a very young company, but we are definitely AIs in our DNA. So everything what we do is based on AI and green energy and scalability. So everything about AI is is, is, is becoming a hot topic and it changes the whole industry. From our point of view, business is, 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 is completely different in the future. Uh, we, are, we are going modular, we are going more into remote places and we are going, we are going in, 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 uh, in land areas where, where digital infrastructure was never been seen before. But yeah, that's what we do. That's fabulous. And I can imagine that is going to affect uh, the, or be very important in the renewable sustainability conversation. Tell us a little bit more about what you're doing there. Yeah, correct. Um, I mean, one hand, um, it's in our DNA that we are doing 100% green energy. So we are in places operating in Latin America, for example, Paraguay is a very uh, huge topic because they have 80% of export of hydro energy, green energy, and that's what we tap into. They're, rather than selling them to Brazil for one cent, we are using it. So on one side, it's about exactly tapping into those big potentials of uh, green energy sources. But on the other side, um, we see that in, for example, Europe, you really need to uh, diversify and um, taking taking deals maybe behind the meter, meaning making direct deals with the solar and offshore wind. So it's it's a creativity play, <laughs> I would say, in the, in ultimately, what we do. And uh, we want to innovate the whole industry. That's fabulous, David. Uh, there's so much being said around this topic here at the International Finance Forum. So we appreciate you talking to us. Thanks for talking to JSA TV. So thank you all for joining us. So stay curious, stay connected, and happy networking.